Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Simone, and today in this video, we are working with Eulair Hair. This is one of their very curly units. It's very pretty, and I wanted to show you how it looks when it's wet and also when it's dry, but I did comb it out. That's why it looks frizzy. Sorry. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and get straight into this video. So this video is very simple. I'm just going to be showing you guys how I just lay my edges with the mousse. Okay, there is no gotta be glue that's being used in this video. So to go ahead and just get my hair started and to set it, I did use some mousse to kind of get the frizzies and fuzz out the way. Next, I went ahead and I immediately cut the lace off. After that, I decided to go ahead and set my part. I know I wanted a middle part with this unit, so I went ahead and set my middle part. Before I get on to finalizing the edges or anything, I wanted to go ahead and flatten the roots. Because the hair is a curly unit, sometimes you do want to go ahead and take that time out to really go in row by row to flatten out the roots. Remember, this is curly hair, so it needs a lot of TLC. And then I went ahead and I wet the ends because you can see that I'm clearly combing out the curls. So to get the curls to be back to normal and blend in with the rest of the hair, I did spray the ends of the hair. Since we have done both sides, now it's actually time to go ahead and just scoop out a little bit of the hairs that you want to leave out. It doesn't have to be a lot. You can make it be a very little bit. You can see on this unit, the frontal of this unit is very full, okay? I don't like my hairlines to be really full because to me, it doesn't give it a natural look. So I went ahead and used a tweezer and kind of tweezed it out a little bit. And now I'm going to go ahead and use the mousse, set it, and then go ahead and cut it and then go into my scoop scoop action. So this is one side of it done, and then I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side. Now this part is a little bit tedious because you wanna kinda go ahead and start setting it, but you don't really have to um, keep it on the wig head for too long because it's gonna really lift up, but you wanna make sure you determine what hairs you want to stick out a little bit as far as the baby hairs, which is why I kinda make it my point to do it on the wig head first before I go ahead and possibly repeat this process on my actual head. I'm working with you layer hair well I'm gonna assume it's pronounced you layer hair <laughs> so I really honestly loved how soft this hair was it's actually really nice really soft the curl stayed it's a very pretty curl but the frontal on this unit is very full so just keep that in mind if you don't like your hair to be really full in the front just know this is probably gonna be a little issue for you and you might have to spend more time really trying to flatten out the top and the rest of the frontal Go ahead and grab a hot comb, a blow dryer, a curling iron to go ahead and lay the hair as flat as possible. You can see while my edges are drying, I did go ahead and take this time out to go ahead and utilize my hot comb. And this video was just very straight and to the point. I did go ahead and try a couple of styles towards the end. So this is how it looks when it's in its middle part. 
the curl looks very pretty once it dries like i said this is how it looks up close and this is all with mousse this is not with gel glue or anything for another style i did go ahead and put the hair behind my ears just to kind of see how it might feel and how it might look and then i went ahead and tied into a little ponytail in the back to kind of get the front to lay even flatter Next, I went ahead and tried a little ponytail just to see. I ended up wearing my hair out, but I wanted to show you guys that you can put it in a ponytail and kind of rock this style if you're totally into low ponytails. And I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys thought down below, and I'll see you in my next one.